Welcome back to Portman Outdoors. In today's video, we are going to install these Milwaukee Packout. Uh, they're Packout systems, so these are the half size Packout boxes. Uh, the top is a toolbox, the bottom is a cooler. We're going to be mounting those in the back of our 2022 Wolverine X4 850 XTR. Um, these brackets right here, not sure how good you can see that. I'll have to get some more light. Came from Unique Off-Road Products. Um, it's part of their system. Uh, they sell it for behind both rear seats. They have another kit that goes, puts another one here and another one up between the back seats up there. So you can run a total of four of these. Um, so I only ordered these two because we have a car seat in the back seat that kind of encroaches on the middle. So um, maybe one day when we're out of car seats, we will add the other two. But for now, we're going to run the toolbox and one cooler. So we have water and other beverages uh, with us on the trail. So I'm going to gather some tools and we'll show you how these get installed. So here, this is the driver's side. Um, you can see I just have this laid in. It uses uh, two of the seat bolts. And then if we look here, there's some little tab covers right here. So you push those towards the front of the machine and then they swivel out. So we need to uncover both these Torx bolts, um, there's two there. So that's going to be a number 30 Torx. And then these seat belt or seat mount bolts are going to be a 12 millimeter. Uh, so I'm going to loosen all these, get this set in place, and bolt it all down. All right, I got this first one on the driver's side bolted down. Um, you can see I have three of the bolts tight. Uh, this one here is a little difficult. Um, I'm using a, a bit socket and my bit socket's not quite long enough to fit through this hole and get that bolt tight in there. Uh, so I'll have to find a different tool to go in there. But there you go for the driver's side. Um, let me grab one of these pack outs um, and I'll slide it on there. Alright, so here we go. I have the pack out toolbox on there um, you set it in you slide it over um, they click in let's see you move some tools here we'll see how tight this fits with the tailgate closed so there you go um, you can see very tight fit um, again we have the duck nets on here so you can kind of tell um, the duck nut just kind of hits it. I think in order to get into the box, we'll probably have to push the net up or undo the corner or something. Um, but yeah, that's how those are. I'm um, gonna get the passenger side installed. We'll get the cooler clicked in and we'll come back to you. All right, we're back. We got both sides done. Um, you can see here they are. They sit nice and flush with the tailgate. Um, again, this one's a cooler. Um, and these do have cleats on the top. That's how the packout system works. Uh, you can click, you know, more accessories on top of here. They do fit very snug. Um, these are pretty much touching the back seat, the back of the back seat. Um, I think that's fine. You can see daylight um, all the way around. So they're not touching the tailgate. Uh, maybe the cooler is. But um, so that's how we're gonna store our stuff and uh, bring drinks with us. So so far, um, to get into these, you do have to take them off the mount, um, undo them. This one here looks like it's empty because of this tray, but that tray comes with it. So what I have in here so far, um, this is like an entrenchment tool that you can change the blade out for. Um, an axe blade, a pickaxe, a hammer, um, and a limb saw. This is a Promark off-road winch kit. Um, this here has a nice little kit. And this one-handed. Uh, so it has gloves in it. We have two tree straps, um, two shackles, and a snatch block. So those are all good to have uh, if you need to get yourself out. Um, if you're in a sticky situation and need the winch and then I have um, uh, Just a smaller toe strap in here. That's good enough for 
the side by sides and the four wheelers. Um, this one does have hooks on it, which I'm not uh, the biggest fan of, but we do have the winch when we need it. So um, that's what I have in here so far. Um, as you could tell, that only filled about half of it. I plan to put some more tools together, um, plug kit, stuff like that for the tires. Uh, put some more stuff like that in this uh, toolbox one and then we're gonna save the cooler one for drinks and water and uh, stuff like that when we're on the trail. Um, I know one place we typically ride is St. Joe State Park and they uh, if they haven't had rain in a while it gets fairly dusty there so it's always good to have water uh, to drink. So there you go that's our Milwaukee, Milwaukee pack out. Um, again these are from Unique Off-Road Products. They have them on their website. Um, they shipped out very quick through uh, USPS, I believe. Um, so if you want some of these for your X4, uh, get on their website, get them ordered. Um, and then you can find the Milwaukee Packout stuff on Amazon, Northern Tool, uh, pretty much anywhere Milwaukee products are sold. Ace Hardware, um, Lowe's, Home Depot. I don't think Lowe's. I think Home Depot is the one that carries Milwaukee. So uh, if you're interested in this, um, get on Unique Off-Road, their website, and get some ordered. Thanks. See you next time. Like, comment, and subscribe.